Hi everyone, welcome back to Trini Kids TV or if this is your first time here, hi and welcome to Circle Time. We start our Circle Time by singing our Good Morning Song. So let's all sing the Good Morning Song together. Ready? Good morning, good morning, good morning, how are you? Good morning, good morning, it's nice to see you too. Good morning, good morning. Good morning, how are you? Good morning, good morning. It's nice to see you too. And a very good morning to all of our friends that are watching. Now, let's start by saying the days of the week and the months of the year. Do you know what day it is today, friends? Well, if yesterday was Wednesday, what comes after Wednesday? Yes, it's Thursday. Today is Thursday. Today is Thursday. All day long. All day long. All right. So today is Thursday and we are still in the month of March. Can we see the days of the week and the months of the year? Well, let's go. The days of the week are Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and Saturday and the months of the year are January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November and December. Great job everyone. Now let's find out about the weather and we find out about our weather by singing our weather song. So let's all sing together. What's the weather like? What's the weather like? What's the weather like today, today? What's the weather like? What's the weather like? What's the weather like today? Well, is it sunny? Is it rainy? Is it windy? Is it cloudy? What's the weather like today? Is it sunny? Is it rainy? Is it windy? Is it cloudy? What's the weather like today? Now, my friends, we can take a look out those windows and see what kind of weather we are having today. Well, take a look. Yes, my friends, today is a sunny day. It's a sunny day today. And there are lots of things that we can do outside, right, friends? So, a sunny day is a great day to be outside. Now, let's find out about our color of the day. Our color of the day today is the color green. Green is our color of the day. Can we think of something that might be green? Well, grass is green. Leaves are green. Lots of things are green. Green is a wonderful color. And it's one of those colors that you need to mix to get. You get green by mixing blue and yellow together and you get green now let's find out about our shape of the day our shape of the day today is a diamond yes just like in the nursery rhyme twinkle twinkle can we sing the nursery rhyme well let's sing together twinkle twinkle little star how i wonder what you are up above the world so high like a diamond in the sky twinkle twinkle little star how i wonder what you are very good everyone that was a really nice little nursery rhyme right now let's find out about our number of the day yes our number of the day today is the number eight what can we do to count to eight well maybe we can snap 
or if you can't snap you can clap and we'll count to eight are you all ready well let's go one two three four five six seven and eight great we counted to eight and we snapped or clapped our hands yeah now let's find out about our letter of the day our letter of the day today is a letter that comes after n in the alphabet it's the letter o yes o is our letter of the day can we think of some words that start with the letter o open oven even a shape has a letter o oval yes there are lots of words that start with the letter o right and our shape of the day brings us to our area of the day our area of the day today is our area of the day is our pooch in south trinidad our pooch is a lovely area and it has a large river the our pooch river so it's a beautiful place to visit now my friends, it's time for our lesson for today. Our lesson for today, we are going to be kind of sequencing our stories by using pictures. So if you missed the Easter story, you can click the link below and watch the Easter story. And then we can take what we know about the Easter story and put them together. We know in the first part of the story, Jesus prays in the garden of Gethsemane. Next, he's arrested after that he is crucified and lastly he rises again on the third day so those are the main parts of the story and we're going to sequence those parts of the story all right so let's get cracking now let's dramatize the easter story now you can do this outside if you want to draw it outside on the ground or you can just have fun inside but it's a beautiful day so you can head outside first we start by remembering the last supper that Jesus had before he was arrested so you can pretend to eat and drink just like Jesus did in the story so go ahead then Jesus prayed in the Garden of Gethsemane just before he was arrested. So let's dramatize the garden prayer by putting our hands together as if we're praying like in our story. Next, Jesus was crucified on the cross. So you can stretch your arms out to the side just like Jesus did on the cross. Next, Jesus was placed in a tomb and then he rose again or he is risen. So you can dramatize this by stooping or crouching down and then standing up as tall and as high as you can. So that's how you dramatize. Great job, everyone. Bye. All right, my friends. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you had fun sequencing the Easter story and learning even more about the Easter story. Now, join us tomorrow where we'll be making a delicious craft to remember our Easter story. So I'll see you tomorrow, friends. Bye.